Let's say I wanna upload a document from Google Drive. I go to Google Drive. The first thing I would normally need to do is sign in. In this case, I'm already signed in, but just put in your email and email password and it'll get you access to your uh, Google document information. So in this case, I'm not gonna upload a PDF. I'm gonna upload a Google Doc. So this is a dyslexia book draft, uh, which is a book about dyslexia that I'm writing. And I'm gonna open it up. Again, I can crop it in whatever way I want. I'll have to wait for a couple of seconds for it to load. Dyslexia book draft, Google Doc. And that is how to upload a document or Google Doc from Google Drive into Speechify so that you can listen to it on your iPhone. Now, if I wanna upload something from Dropbox, I have to make sure that I first have the Dropbox app on my phone. Once I have the Dropbox app and I'm signed in on Dropbox, I can click Dropbox. It'll first allow me to allow Dropbox, ac Dropbox access, but now I can pull any document from Dropbox into my phone. So let's say I wanna start off by listening to, um, all right, I have this Word document about my world views that I wanna listen to. So I'll wait for it to load, I'll click select, create, it'll take a couple of seconds to load. Go analysis of your worldview, particular attention to be paid to breaking points. So this is a Word document that I now uploaded. And that's how to import documents into Speechify. You can also import documents from OneDrive, uh, Box, or Safari. And the next thing I'll show you is how to import a document from Safari. In this video, I'm going to show you how to import a document from Safari into Speechify.